Leslie here with the unboxing of my 2023 Erin Condren Life Planner. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get started. The only thing I've checked on is that there actually is a planner in this box. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing is this little card. Sometimes it's in like a newspaper or a magazine, um, but it says the theme, Harmony, Finding Peace in the Perfectly Imperfect. And then it has like the 15% off coupon code right here. I don't think that's unique to me. I don't know. I mean, I guess you guys could use it if you want to. I feel like I never remember to, or I don't know. Usually they're on little cards, so I don't know. And then this backside usually features something new, which it is. It says coming in July, and it says back to school collection. So I'm going to zoom in on that, like let you guys focus on that. Um, so the first thing it says is a pastel functional planner sticker book. It's $15.50. The backpack so cute, but $92. And then it says number three, soft bound academic planner, $30. And then colorful fine liner pens, a 10 pack for $15.50. Adjustable wood laptop stand, $26. Oh, magnetic ballpoint pen duo is $12.50. Repositional weekly whiteboard and notepad. Oh, I kind of like that idea. $38. Gold bookmark ruler. It's a ruler? I guess so. Can't quite tell. $12. A blush calculator, which is really cute, is $14. I feel like we all use our phones, but that would be cute for like your desk or like if you're wanting stuff to like decorate your desk for a photo shoot. Color changing brush markers. Six pack is $15.50. What do they mean color changing? Ooh, that's interesting. All right. That's pretty awesome. That's pretty awesome. Oh yeah. It says my coat on the front is unique. Well, <laughs> if you guys use it, I don't really care. <laughs> So, because <laughs> it says the coupon code expires October 1st of 2022. So the first person that uses it, uses it. I don't really care. <laughs> All right. We have navy blue tissue paper in my box. Not sure if that's the same in every box. My box is kind of navy blue as well. Um, and then let's go ahead and pull this open. All right. So I did get the tote bag. It looks like there's a little string. It's a canvas tote bag. It looks a lot bigger than I thought. Yeah, it is. I kind of thought it was about the size of a planner. So it has the theme on it. Oh, no, it doesn't. It has something else. It says, let go and live in the moment. But it does have the tissue paper design on it. Um, I can see it's already pretty transparent. So it's kind of a thin canvas bag. I use my other bag that I got. I don't know if I got it in an Erin Condren seasonal surprise box or if I got it in purchasing an Erin Condren. Um, but it was the one that like you can wrap it up and it's a reusable tote bag and it had the woven pattern, the woven um, release on it. The It was like the lines. Um, and I use that all the time actually to mail orders or if I'm picking stuff up at the Asian World Food Market or like Aldi's or something. So it has these nice little canvas straps. I'm seeing like some stain. I don't know. Whatever. It's probably from this. So I like it. I think it's handy. It's useful. It does not have like a wide bottom or anything. It's just like a line bottom. So it's just like a folded symbol canvas. It's not going to like stand up on its own or anything like that. Nothing too fancy, but I appreciate it. It's useful. All right. Then we have the planner that I ordered. So I'm going to go ahead and move the box because nobody needs to see that anymore. Moving it kind of noisily. It's fine. I also have my current planner next to me in case I need to do some comparisons. Um, so already you can see that there's the little um, bookmark here. It looks like they didn't give me one that matches like um, their theme. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. I have some past bookmarks. Why do I say them? I don't know. Um, this one had the theme on it one year. I forget what the theme was. <laughs> But it had like the line, it was like crystals. I remember it was like a crystal thing. Um, but it looks like this year they went with a simple like um, Aaron Condren asterisk looking one. So I don't know a lot of people that like use these completely. I feel like if you do, you might use it as a bookmark. I don't know. But I don't find myself using a ruler a lot when I plan. So I went with the Blooms cover in the colors that it traditionally came in. Um, I opted to not do customization. So there's no like name down here or anything like that. So let's go ahead and pop this open. All right, so what I see so far, oh, my coil is that platinum silver and that's what I ordered. So that's nice. And then the lovely barcode that's always there. All right, it looks like I have a little packet of goodies to open up. So let's go ahead and start with that then. 
I'm doing like a true unboxing. I haven't looked in here. They usually include these little cute cards. Oh, there's my 20% off. Yeah, I don't care if you take the 15. You go for it, girl. <laughs> All right, so these are, some are foiled. That's beautiful. So look at that. It says, follow your passion and ignite your potential. That means you, because I just said it to you. These are like little fortune cookie cards. That's what it reminds me of. And then there's like a blank back. Ooh, this one's foiled, silver foiling. You are beautiful, capable, and worthy. Yes, please. And then this one, it should be, it's the blooms and it's foiled. So I could have um, upgraded to foiling in my cover, but it was like another $10, so <laughs> I didn't. All right, this one says, even when it seems impossible, continue to believe in yourself. I love this one. This one's staying with me. And I'm probably going to put it on one of my handy dandy tabs. I have like an air, or I have a happy planner one next to me, but you can snap these onto a tab and then like keep them in your planner as a little bookmark. So I sell the tabs. All right. And then we have these little stickers it says just a little something from, so it's a little address label. I feel like I never use these. Do you use these? I feel like I never remember I even have them that they exist. This one looks like hollow foil. So those are always fun. All right, and then my 20% off, it says share the savings with a friend. So I do have two on here. Um, I'm going to keep those top secret for now. <laughs> top secret. All right, life planner card. Welcome to the EC family. We're so happy you decided to invest in yourself and your future goals. In buying Erin Condren Life Planner, you've joined a community, Million Strong, that believe in the power of putting pen to paper. We are here to support you along your organization journey, whether that's one rooted in professional, personal, budgeting, wellness, or self-care goals. We know committing to a routine or system can be challenging, so follow us on social media for helpful hacks and organization inspiration. And it has their socials. That's so cute. And then it says, enjoy 20% off your next purchase. Use the code on the discount card in your Life Planner gift. I already have that. All right, and then we have here the Life Planner difference. 91% of Life Planner customers report that it helps. That's nice. Look at those stats. Um, you get 20% off the compliment cards, gift labels, and more. Um, planning tips are on their website, and they have a ton of accessories. Um, the EC Insider Loyalty Program for Perks. So if you sign up for that, not only do you get like the sneak peeks of their new releases, um, sometimes they do the occasional like flash sale and stuff like that. So it's just, and then you get like points whenever you purchase or whenever someone uses your referral code. Okay, so the inside, I went with the um, Harmony Neutrals. So that's what you're seeing on this like acetate tissue paper. This feels thicker than last year's. Ooh, are we already ready to compare? Are we already comparing? Okay, no, it's the same. Although this one has no pattern on it whatsoever. So that was disappointing. <laughs> I guess I guess I didn't get that. <laughs> All right, so then here it just says life planner vertical layout, hopefully. Um, and then it says, this is my life and I put my name in there. So I sell like the custom vinyl stickers. I don't know if mine's in here. No, I haven't put one in here yet. I'm so bad at this. Um, but I have one of my other ones. I have one of my other ones, but I sell custom vinyl word stickers that you can stick in your planner. Here's my like run with craft scissors name. So I could put this across here if I wanted to, that would be fun. So you can customize. Oh, here's my name. I found my name here. So we could stick this one in here. Okay. So personalizing with a vinyl sticker is always fun. All right, moving on, moving on. So this one says the very best plans emerge when different perspectives meet. So this is the Harmony Neutral. I didn't go with the blooms because of the flowers. I'll show you in a second. This is the other freebie you got for ordering early. Um, it says it's a metal bookmark sticky flag set. I think there was two options for either the tote bag or the sticky notes. And I said not the sticky notes because um, Aaron Condon's sticky notes are notoriously not very sticky. <laughs> At least the ones I have. I have a whole set and they are not. So this is big metal clip. It looks like a money clip, you guys. This is honking. Um, it's pretty heavy. It's not super lightweight. Should I pull some strips out and see how this works? Oh, look at that. Okay, so how sticky is this? It's fairly sticky. Is it removable? There's supposed to be flags, so it shouldn't like tear. Oh, that's very gentle. It's like washi tape gentle. Yeah, those are fun. They're very smooth, like glossy. I'm not sure about writing. We might have to do a pen test. We might have to do that. Um, I'm not sure how you go about refilling 
These, this looks like it's in a cardboard box. This looks like it's made out of cardboard. So I wonder if you just pull this off and put a new one in? I'm not really sure. I need directions. Are these refillable? No, no clue. No idea. Okay, moving that to the side. <laughs> All right, here's your uh, monthly overview for the neutral. And then you get this, a goal is a dream with a deadline. Ooh, that's intense. That's intense. So you could put every month here in like a monthly goal. And then there's like a journaling line page for you. And then the tab for January says discover the power when you choose to connect. Um, I plan on decorating these. I usually do with like extra stickers. I probably have already with this one. Okay, January, I haven't. February, February. Oh yeah, I started putting your guys' names in it for <laughs> donating to the channel. Um, and then I started putting deco next to your guys' names. So I like to decorate um, my little dashboard dividers. So I don't mind that they're like super neutral. All right, here's the monthly overview. So the only color is this top part. Um, I've been really bad about even using my monthly view, but just to compare. So I did um, the neutral inside, but it had colorful tabs last year. So you guys can kind of see it's a big difference because it's over here to the side. The font is definitely different. Um, and then this one only had lines. It didn't have the colored lines right here. So there's a big difference for you, I think, possibly. The lines on the left-hand side seem pretty similar but this is definitely a bolder font, and then it's got those colored lines under each one. Okay, and then our weekly spread. So this is like your, see I like to compare this page too, so I'm gonna bring my other planner back in. Um, but it's kind of like your currently page, or this month you could be setting goals. Um, I can show you guys a couple of mine if I have done any. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. Um, so this one, um, I had goals and then to buy and like things like that. It looks pretty similar, even the four dots. Um, this one has kind of a header line and some lines, but they stuck with the grid dot and then there's like an accent line down here. So not a lot of difference in that setup at all. Even the boxes are rounded corner. The pages seem creamier colored. Is that just me? Maybe it's me. <laughs> it could be me. All right, here's the first weekly spread. So our weekly view, I need to flip to a weekly view so we can compare. <laughs> so you can see they started abbreviating the month up here um, and then putting the year here. It's the full month word. Um, and then you have just, it looks like normal numbers. I feel like these numbers have more flair to them because like the, the second number is like bigger than the first number. So that's kind of interesting. And then they did stick with putting the monthly overview down here in the bottom corner. Um, there's lines, headers, all of this looks pretty much exactly the same. Etsy shops should be very thankful for that if they are sticker makers, because it looks the same to me. I did not grab a sticker kit to like test. Um, my advice to you is yes, flip through every single page when you get your planner. Um, but I'm not going to do that with you guys today. I'm just going to skip to the divider tabs so we can see what these little divider tabs say. So the best way to predict your future is to create it. All these quotes seem very fortune cookie. <laughs> and then this one says, when you find balance, you find peace. That's March, April, the strongest version of yourself can emerge from the toughest of circumstances. May, this one's like blue. May says, let go of what you can't control and just breathe. Okay, I'm aware. <laughs> work with a plan and hard work. You can achieve anything. And then this one says, when it seems impossible, continue to believe in yourself. This one's got some brown tones. I kind of wish these were brighter, but I wanted the neutral spread, so... That's my, like, I always feel like there's something I end up sacrificing in exactly what I wanted, even though they have, like, a lot of ways for you to customize your planner. Mine says everything. That's true. You matter just as you are for September. October, there is no force more powerful than determination to create change. And then November, we have serenity. It comes when you make peace with your present. I like how they start including the little Aaron Condren asterisks in here, although it makes me think that there's like a footnote that I don't know about, but <laughs> I do like it. I think it's cute that they're kind of throwing that back in there. There is power and kindness for December. 
and then we'll go ahead and go to our notes pages. I will say the pages are very transparent. Is that how my current planner is? Are you very transparent? Are you? And I just never noticed how transparent you were. Yeah, it's pretty transparent. I can see through it just like this one. So I think the paper quality is probably the same. Um, so line paper, line paper, more lines, more lines. Ooh, lots of line paper. What is this? Okay. I feel like that's way more. There's like four or five pages in here. I feel like that's way more than my notes section in here that I never use. Is it the same? I never use it. No, it's about the same. Oh, this one might have more. One, two, three, four, five. Mm, maybe about the same. There's a contacts tab. This one doesn't seem to have, so I guess we don't do that anymore. Oh, no, there is. They just didn't create a tab for it. Ooh, they didn't create a tab for it, but it is in here. They have um, a contacts page. Let's keep in touch, name, and then you can put phone number or email. Um, and this one had a tab for it. it said contacts. Pretty similar setup though. They did all lowercase here and here. They did all uppercase. That's about it. Um, heritage and awareness observances. Um, that is not in this planner. In my old planner, that's new. This is new. All the other holidays that they've got. National Adoption Month. Like It just varies. International Workers Day. I'm just grabbing some. Black History Month begins. Those are awesome. Oh, they have it starting in August of 2022. That's funny. Because you can start your planner in July or whatever. All right, and then here's your, like, a month, um, monthly overview again. Do I have one of those in here? Maybe? Yeah. So that looks the same if you're one of those for pre-planning the next year. If you're wanting to write down dates and events. Um, those are still in there. And so is their disclaimer. <laughs> it's so funny. All right, and then this last page, they always include one more quote, what you think you create, what you feel you attract, what you imagine you become. Um, this one was spread the power of infinite possibility. So definitely a different quote. Stickers I always forget about. Am I the only one? I always forget about these stickers. Like hands down, always forget about them until I get like another new planner. They are cute. They are so cute. Look at this, they're adorable. Okay, so we're gonna compare this one to the next one. Um, I don't know what this is. Oh, it's like extra holiday stickers that I was not aware of. <laughs> oh, okay, so did they not include this sticker sheet in here because they made that list? We will have to see. Okay, circles, flags. Um, to do this week, we scheduled to do um, habit trackers. That looks pretty similar to the other one. Um, a happy birthday page, that's very similar. This one is in gold, everything is gold foiled. And then we have some corner boxes with rose gold foiling. And then um, we have a little pocket that has some silver foiling on it, which is nice because I like, didn't pay for foiling in my thing. Okay, so this one didn't come with that extra sticker with the dates on it, with the, I don't know. And then you always get one of these, it's a perpetual calendar. I'm not sure if you guys are familiar with this, um, there was a flaw in this last year. Um, something was printed wrong. <laughs> I forget what it was. So basically you can write down something um, next to each day and it's something that may be on the same day every day. But I've said maybe if you want to like start um, a thankful everyday journal or just jotting down something for the day, um, this would be a quick and easy way to do it. You could, It's really small. You could keep it in your purse or backpack or something like that. Um, Maybe it was the contact page. I don't know. There was something that had like a, oh yeah, it was important contacts and important passwords. That's what was messed up in this one. I remember now because I think I was one of the few people that even like caught it. I probably still have it in here because that's what I do. Um, no, it wasn't that part. I don't know. There was one time where it did that, I guess. I don't know. I just remember there was a flaw in one of these ones, but no one really cared because I don't feel like a lot of people use this anyway. All right, there's more holidays and dates. So this was the perpetual calendar last year. This is the one this year. They kept the exact same quote and just changed the calendar. The color. I can't talk. <laughs> they changed the color. So this one's foiled in gold and this one's foiled in rose gold. So this is last year's and this is this year's. So that's interesting. 
All right, here's my back cover. You can buy those like white whiteboard or not whiteboard, like overhead markers that like don't erase too, too easy. Um, you can use that on there or like I put a sticker pocket or something on it. And then there's the back of the floral blooms, the bloom one. So let me know in the comments below what you ordered or what you plan on ordering. Um, if you are going vertical, neutral, they have a bunch of like A5 now. I did see the one with like the cover that was really pretty. I wish they would make um, covers like leather or pleather covers for these where like the back page slips into it, kind of like the old Happy Planner ones with a snap cover. Um, just to protect the um, corners of your planner, I would appreciate that. But um, so far they haven't really done anything like that. They've made like a zip bag that you could put your planner in. Um, but other than that, they haven't really done that. So that would be something that I would hope that the Erin Condren team is working on. I would like that. <laughs> um, I think other people would as well. So there you go. That's my planner for 2023. You will not see this planner on my channel again until the last week of December because I usually film about a week in advance and I always jump into my new planner um, for the first week. So this one falls the day after Christmas actually. So we'll be planning in this um, come December of 2022. That's when you guys will see this come back up. I just always like to order it ahead of time so I can get all the cool freebies and unbox it for you guys and show you um, no flaws this year, as far as I can tell, until I go week by week and check each page. <laughs> See if anything's missing a line or a page is printed upside down or something. But yes, check your planners. Um, last year, my flaw was my coil color was wrong. Um, it was actually rose gold, which I think you had to pay for as an upgrade. Um, and so I didn't really care. And then one year they sent me a horizontal um, layout. So definitely check your planners and make sure there's no flaws when they arrive. So you can contact customer service as soon as possible because they have always worked really well for me. I've never had a problem dealing with their customer service. Um, so there you go. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, leave a comment down below, like I said, on what you plan on getting. I would love to know. And I think that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.